was my savior. Really? Because I found out when I became vegan that the hardest part was not becoming vegan and eating vegan food. It was the social aspect of it. Coming to this event, which we're at a vegan meetup, I made a friend with her, you know? <laughs> the basic vegan bitch. Step one is check out meetup.com. We went here and started a meetup about eight years ago called Vegan Drinks and it was awesome. We met so many cool vegans. So just type in vegan, do the mile radius close to your house and see if anything pulls up. We actually just started a new meetup called Mr. and Mrs. Vegan. We're here at the first ever Mr. and Mrs. Vegan meetup. Come on inside and let's see who's in here. Another awesome way to find vegan friends and amazing vegan food is happycow.com. Just go ahead and type in your city and see what pulls up. There could be awesome vegan vegetarian friendly restaurants. Here's Chani where we had our vegan meetup. And what's really cool about Happy Cow is that you can scroll down, read all the reviews. I mean, look at this one. It said outstanding oil-free vegan food. And you just go ahead and click on them. Well, there's Mr. Vegan. Let's just go ahead and send him a message. Maybe he'll want to meet up sometime and have some oil-free vegan food with me. And you can just put in, hey, I liked your review. Maybe let's meet up sometime and grab some Indian food. So I have to tell you guys, this is the way we met our first vegan friend. We did exactly this. We saw that she was commenting. We were commenting on the same restaurants. We messaged her and then we met up and she became one of our really good friends. first and then I couldn't find any friends <laughs> so I had to look up friends online and we talked to each other online first and then oh let's meet up because we live close by. So was it through Instagram or was it through Facebook? Uh, it was through Instagram mostly. You guys know Instagram is an amazing place to meet new vegan friends. In this case I'm heading to Chinese page and I'm just scrolling through a couple of the pictures. This one looks really pretty and yeah this person looks pretty cool basic vegan bitch <laughs> i'm gonna go ahead and like her photo start following her and then just comment on her photos and form a relationship that way and then maybe after that dm her and see if she wants to meet up sometime and grab some yummy food or you know you just comment that you want to you know meet up in the comments i mean basic vegan bitch would love to have food with anybody she's so cool and so fun make vegan friends if social media is it's so easy now it's like yeah you know, um, if, you're, if you're on YouTube you don't have to be making videos to start chatting with people another place to find awesome vegan is Twitter just go ahead and enter vegan in your city name and see what pulls up and then also they have vegan events what is this a vegan street fair I'm down for that I'm gonna follow them too. Jason Warble very cool yes I'm gonna follow him as well See, there's so many awesome people in your city that you don't even know about. They might be on Twitter. And you know, just start connecting and tweeting back to them. What's this? I was filmed in Los Angeles for a video with Mr. and Mrs. Vegan last week. <laughs> I'll definitely like that. And yep, I'm gonna be following Robert Cheek as well. Okay. Inspired you guys to come to this meetup today. Vegan friends. Well, Facebook is great.
great. But so how, how do you use Facebook to, to meet? I don't... There's Facebook groups. Oh, the groups on Facebook. Yeah, exactly. That's the first step. Then you actually have to go. <laughs> and when you get there, you have to just push beyond your comfort zone and talk to people. So I think once you start talking to people and you start hearing their stories, you start swapping sort of like how you became vegan, yeah. what type of vegan you are, yeah. like what kind yeah. of vegan food you like to eat. <laughs> then you figure out, you know, who's in that same kind of vibe as you. That's awesome. And then you start hanging out <laughs> and then you meet their friends and so on and so on. Facebook is another awesome resource. Just go ahead and type vegan in your city name and see what pulls up. Here we see a couple of different pages. Here's someone talking about a vegan burrito. What is a vegan California burrito? We'll see the latest so you can see all the stories that are talking about vegan things in your area with vegan in their name and then photos. Photos is a great way to find out what people are eating and who's eating it. Here's Liz. Oh, I love Liz. And Ben and Jerry just came out with vegan ice cream. Very exciting. Been eating some yummy vegan treats. And then places, I guess this is more vegan food restaurants. We are so lucky here. My favorite part about Facebook is vegan groups. Look at all these groups. Vegan Girlfriends of Los Angeles. I'm gonna join that one. Los Angeles Vegetarians and Vegans, join. The Los Angeles Vegan Food Club. Yep, I'm down. And then lastly, vegan events. Oh my gosh, look at all these amazing events. And I am so interested in this. What is going on here? A vegan street fair. I've never even heard of this before. Wow. I am 100% liking this and signing up. Friends. How do you make vegan friends? Vegan friends. Well, I have one so far that's been to this meetup. Um, how I met her, she's my best friend. But I tried to get all my friends to become vegan. Oh, nice. So that's what I'm trying to do. <laughs> that's awesome. If all else fails. It's about turning your existing friends or family vegan. So how do you do that? Let's go ahead and Google how to turn your friends vegan. Let's see what comes up. So we have the Vegetarian Resource Group blog. They have a couple helpful tips. Let's see what else we have. Scroll down here. Oh, veganize your friends in three easy steps. I like steps. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna hit up videos and what do we have? Turning your friends vegan. Ooh, this looks really good. I love Delicious Journey. I'm definitely subscribing. This is awesome. She is so cool. Alex and I moved just for vegans. I don't know if a lot of you will know that, but that's really the only reason we're in Los Angeles. And we have never looked back. Like, we are so happy here. So I suggest anybody, if you're not happy in your city and the people around you aren't positive, and a great influence on your health and you know where you want to be in your life, I seriously would consider moving. So let's go ahead and Google the best vegan friendliest cities and see what those are. So I'm looking Happy Cow right now and it's saying Berlin, New York, Portland, San Francisco, London. I've gone to two meetups, so I met some of my friends there. Um, the person that I came with to this meetup, I actually met her last week at <laughs> If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and comment below and let us know how you made your vegan friends. Who knows, you might make another.